is avocado diabetics. Diabetes, as we know, is a complicated disease, and in order to effectively manage the chronic illness, one has to take a lot of measures with respect to the diet and lifestyle. One of the much-loved fruit all across the world is avocado. Most of the diabetic patients therefore often ask the question is avocado good or bad for diabetics? In this article, we shall deep dive and try to analyze the relationship between avocado and diabetes in detail. Let us first understand some of the facts related with avocados. The fruit is a rich source of antioxidants and minerals such as potassium, vitamin E as well as vitamin C. The fruit is known to be rich in a number of vitamin B such as riboflavin, pyridoxin, niacin, amongst others. They contain high amount of fats, but the same is in the form of monosaturated fats, something that is considered good for diabetes. An average medium-sized avocado has around 17 grams of carbohydrates relationship between avocado and the blood sugar level. As per the United States Department of Agriculture, an average size of the fruit contains around 17 grams of carbohydrates. Hence, avocado is a fruit which you can include in your diet without worrying about the increase in the levels of blood glucose. In fact, studies have shown that, when you combine this fruit with other foods as part of your diet, any increase in the level of blood glucose is said to decline and stabilize. Other benefits of eating avocado for people suffering from diabetes. Eating and including avocado has several health benefits apart from the advantage of stabilizing the level of blood glucose in the body. Some of the other benefits of the fruit include the following. The fruit is a rich source of fiber. Avocados are also rich in what is known as the soluble fiber. This, in turn, helps to it as well as the pancreas, the organs that are responsible for releasing insulin. As per the National Institute of Diabetes and Digestive and Kidney Diseases the monosaturated fats present in the fruit improves the level of good cholesterol, triglycerides, thereby reducing the chances of getting strokes or even heart attacks. Monosaturated fats present in the fruit also helps in the promotion of insulin levels, which again is an important factor that will benefit those with a chronic illness. Finally, the fruit goes a long way in keeping the levels of electrolytes up. When the body has raised levels of blood glucose due to diabetes, it faces an electrolyte imbalance as the increase in blood sugar is balanced by the kidneys by releasing water. It is important to restore this balance for avoiding a lot of diseases and avocado helps in achieving the same. Thus, there are several benefits of avocado, and the fruit can certainly be included in the diets of all the people who suffer from diabetes. Recommended quantity of avocado for diabetes are including in their daily diet. Also, you should understand and consider the total amount of calories that you are eating. The whole fruit contains around 250 to 300 calories. And one ounce serving of avocados contains only as little as 50 counts of calories. Hence after considering everything and properly balancing their diet with the adequate amount of nutrients, vitamins, etc. Avocado can easily be included in the diet of a person suffering from diabetes. You can easily make the fruit a part of your overall diabetic meal plan.